Uh, Mark, congratulations again. It's five games unbeaten. Uh, how would you sum up that performance today? Um, re really pleasing first half. You know, ev everything that we wanted off them, everything we worked for on Thursday night. You know, we was quite disappointed really with the Kettering performance, frustrated. Um, so it's really pleasing that they've actually took on board what we worked on, how we, how we wanted to play, implemented it, had the quality to deliver it. Um, and then second half, it was, it was more sort of like we're going to keep what we're, you know, what we've got, uh, which became a solid defensive performance. You know, I can criticise anything, it's, we should have been maybe further up in the first half. Um, but that's hard, hard to do when they've played so well and created so many good chances uh, and domi dominated Hereford really. Yeah. How much did the game hinge on those first few minutes where at one end Jordan Nicholson goes in one and one, Cam Mason makes a great save and then straight up the other end we win a penalty? Yeah, well when you're on runs and you're working hard that kind of thing happens. You know, they got in I think on Monday night Kettering with, with one, uh, one chance and you know we got away with it, simple as that. Cam made a great save, as he has been doing. Um, and then 30, 30, 40 seconds later, we, we've got a penalty to take the lead. Uh, so it was, it was pleasing that we've got such a reliable, good keeper. Uh, and also that we, we're gaining some rewards for how much effort the lads are putting in, uh, how much they're taking on board, how we want to play. Uh, and. Hopefully, it'll continue. Yeah, uh, four clean sheets in a row now as well. Uh, is there anything you can put that down to that that run? Well, just self belief. You know, we we've challenged them, and all season when when we've struggled in terms of results, we haven't uh, put bad performances in. We just haven't been good enough in both penalty areas, and that's where games are won and lost. Um, you know, we've competed with everybody we've played. Uh, and never shied away from anything, you know, I would, wouldn't say that any player lacked confidence at any time, they've all stuck together um, and all of a sudden, you know, we brought a couple of players in that, that have clicked and all, we, look, we look like we're full of belief now and we can go out and we can keep clean sheets and we can score goals um, and we can handle the ball in tight situations, all, all the things that make a good team. Yeah, you mentioned there about new players coming in and obviously we had players coming back as well. How big an impact has Robbie Evans made since his return? Because it seems to have coincided with this good run of form. Yeah, when, when we brought Robbie in, we knew what we was getting. You know, we, we was getting that player who don't only drive himself forward, he drives the team forward. Um, you know, to lose him for so long was devastating. Um, but now that he's back, we've got to manage him and and I, I feel they'll only get better. And I hope he's at the club for, for a long time. Yeah, heading into next week's game now against AFC Fylde, the confidence must be very high for that game. Yeah, well, it's, it's a game where we have nothing nothing to fear, really. You know, we can go in that game, we want to make a good account of ourselves. You know, we want to go up against a side from a higher level, the holders of the cup, uh, and, and show what we can do. And there's no reason why we can't compete with them. There's no reason why you know, we can't cause them problems and, you know, whether they have priorities of the trophy or, or their priorities are, are within the league, you know, they, they can put a, a very good side out with, prof you know, professional players, full-time players. You know, the manager is, you know, is a very hungry manager with a, with a great record at Markham. Um, so, we go there with no fear, a game that we can look forward to. Uh, and. You know, we'll, we'll be putting in a similar performance to today.